What up, YouTube fam? It's April G. Showers back at you with a reaction. We got Mickey Fax Wraith produced by Awesome J. I'm excited for this. This is a six minute long track, too. <coughs> Excuse me, Mickey Fax is full of bars. So, this is going to be a long reaction. I'm a reaction. Bar Breakdown channel, y'all. So if y'all don't like people dissecting lyrics and bars and stuff like that and a lot of pausing, then I'm not for you, unfortunately. But I'm very excited about this. Love Mickey Fax. Love him to death. He is the homie. He was in my one-year anniversary, one-year YouTube anniversary video that a bunch of YouTubers got together and made for me uh, and surprised me with for my one year anniversary on YouTube back in November. Mickey Fax was in it. Uh, no Life Shack was in it. Uh, a bunch of different people. It's over 30 people in it. It's the highlighted video on my channel. It's uh, called Did This Really Just Happen? That's the title of the video. Uh, if y'all want to watch it, it's pretty cool but um it's the nicest thing anybody's ever done for me in my life but i'm remaining unbiased unbiased and i will say exactly how i feel about everything once i've heard it in its entirety um the cover art to bar i see that immediately i mean it's a rolls royce on fire. The title's a bar, Wraith, and he put the I small because if you take the I out of Wraith, that's wrath. We know what wrath means, but Wraith means ghost or a ghost like figure. So, you know, just the title of cover art alone. <laughs> I mean, Mickey said, I, I'm about to lyrically kill you, my guy. So I'm excited, y'all. I will provide the link, as always, in the description box. Please be sure to click on that link, like, comment, share, subscribe, all the wonderful stuff after my reaction. All right. April Jeep Squad, fist bump, love y'all. Let's get it. My brain's just in the heart like a mofo. Mickey. Hurts when you gotta kill a nigga you love. So good though. So so. No more talking, nigga. Look, all this chatter for hours is really silly, nigga. With no rapping, I swear you gotta be backwards. No matter how many flowers you try to give a nigga, it's like they only want them on top of the casket. Damn. No matter how many flowers you try to give somebody, it's like they only want them on top of the casket. Like I try, try to give him his flowers while he's alive, but he, all he wants to do is put me down and bully me and shit or whatever, whatever. So I guess he'll be getting his flowers on his casket because I'm about to lyrically kill him. Bars. Flowers you try to give a nigga, it's like they only want them on top of the casket. Damn. Pay the price for acting ladylike. We really see black M&Ms. Kind of shady, right? You sent the shot, so I flash back like it's 80s night. Playing. Oh my god, bro. Ace, hey, so we rarely see black M&Ms. It's kind of shady, right? Because Eminem the candy, you rarely see black Eminems. It's kind of shady, right? Get it? And then all, the obvious Eminem Slim Shady reference. Also, and then call it, also call it, that's like a triple, of, I believe, you know. 
I believe it's a triple. It could be more than that. Hell, with Mickey, who knows? But, uh, also, say a Royce, you know, trying to be like Eminem. Black M&M's, kind of shady, right? You sent the shot, so I flash back like it's 80s night. You sent a shot, so I flash back like it's 80s night. Flashbacks. A flashback is something you had, like, I have PTSD. I have flashbacks. And, you know... A flashback is like flashback of something that happened in the past. It's like in the past a flashback. He said, "Like the like the '80s, I flash." Hold on. Be black M and M's, kind of shady, right? You sent the shot, so I flash back like it's '80s night. You sent a shot, so I flash back like it's '80s night. So he say Royce, you know, took shots at Mickey. And then Mickey is shooting back, flash, that's, an, that's also slang for shooting back, like it's 80s, not, you get it, bruh. Black M&M's, kind of shady, right? You sent the shot, so I flash back like it's 80s night. Playing big, I put you in the box, that was Gravy's plight, thought I was hot. Playing big, I put you in a box that was Gravy's plight. First off, R.I.P. Biggie. But he's like, you know, you talk, you playing all big and tough, acting all big and tough. I put you in a box. Put you in a box like a pine box, a casket. Also, then he said that was Gravy's plight. The dude that played Biggie in damn the two movies, his he, his name was Gravy something, and he was put and he was put in this box as like. You get what I'm saying, bruh. For acting ladylike, we really see black M&M's Kind of shady, right? You sent the shot, so I flash back like it's 80s night Playing big, I put you in the box That was Gravy's plight Thought I was hijacking that live Now I'm taking flight you Thought I was hijacking that live Now I'm taking flight You hijack an airplane That means you're now in control of that airplane Take a flight, bruh. Put you in the box, that was Gravy's plight. Thought I was hijacking that live. Now I'm taking flight. Your girl in the ghost and gobbling dick. Say goodnight, you know how. Your girl in the ghost and gobbling dick. Say goodnight. Ghost, reference to the title of the song. Jack in that live, now I'm taking flight. Your girl in the ghost and gobbling dick. Say goodnight. You know how I Rolls Royce. Chess move. You know how I Rolls Royce. Chess move, bruh. Oh my god, and I'm just 51 seconds in this biatch. Ain't a goblin a car, too? It's like. Is there a car called Goblin or am I tripping? I don't know. Your flight, your girl in the ghost and Goblin dick. Say goodnight, you know how I Rolls Royce. Chess move, you see Ryan. Reynolds wrapped in a lagoon, that's a Deadpool. Yeah. Ooh! Ooh, you see Ryan Reynolds wrapped in a lagoon, that's a Deadpool. Ryan Reynolds, the actor, played. Bruh, Deadpool. And then Roy Royce's name is Ryan. You see, Ryan. Hold on. 
Royce. Chess move. You see Ryan Reynolds wrapped in a lagoon. That's a Deadpool. You see Ryan Reynolds wrapped in a lagoon. That's a Deadpool. You see Ryan Reynolds wrapped like in a body bag in a lagoon. A body of water. That's a Deadpool. Okay, so first off, the Ryan Reynolds Deadpool movie bar. Second off, the wrap it, put him in a body bag, basically, and put him, throwing him in a lagoon or water. Two, so like physically killing him, lyrically killing him. That that would be a triple entendre, and then Reynolds rap. Is fucking aluminum full. That's four. That's quad. A uh, fucking quad. Bruh. Oh my. Holy. M I am so here for this shit. I hope everybody gets involved. I highly doubt Eminem will get involved. But this is an amazing. And uh, in the words of script work, shout out script work. It's a fine time for hip hop. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And I'm here for it. And I hope everybody gets involved. Rolls Royce, chess move. You see Ryan Reynolds wrapped in a lagoon. That's, That's a, a dead pool. pool. Yeah. Lupe freestyled and got you out of here. You cried alone from playing yourself. Shed a solid tear. All that syllable, blibble, little loop is kind of weird. It dresses you up from being direct because you probably scared. Ooh. All that syllable, blah, 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 blah. it's kind of weird. It dresses you up because you're probably scared, and it keeps you from being direct. I said it in my reaction to Royce's thing that I forgot it was a diss because he talked about all kind of like real life shit, but he didn't really say all too much about Lupe. Like it wouldn't. In my opinion, it was not a real diss track. This is a real diss track. Lupe's was a real diss track. Royce's was more technicality, lyrical, showing my rapping skills, and taking a couple shots at, at Lupe and Mickey in the process is what Royce's track was. Now, that's not taking anything away from Royce. He's an amazing lyricist. Amazing. But if we're looking at this from a diss track point of view, which is how we should be looking at it, It's kind of weird. It dresses you up from being direct because you probably scared. Your fans say I'm on a rampage. Better reunite, slaughterhouse, and get cut. You need your band aid. I told him, prove you do it. Oh my god. Rampage. Better reunite, slaughterhouse, and get cut. You need your band aid. I you better reunite, slaughterhouse, and get you. Hold on. Say I'm on a rampage. Better reunite, slaughterhouse, and get cut. You need your band aid. I and get cut. You need your band aid. If you get cut, you put a band aid on it. You know, like an actual cut on your skin. You put a band aid on it. And then Slaughterhouse was the rap group that Royce was in with Crooked, Joel Ortiz. Joe Budden, he's like, you need to reunite them back because you need your band aid. You need them to aid you, help you. <laughs> Rap, battle, come on, bro. And say I'm on a rampage. Better reunite, slaughterhouse, and get cut. You need your band aid. I told him, prove you do what I do. He gave me lampshade and said, no. I gave the bitch room and then the man cave. Woo! Divide his body. Oh my god. Better reunite slaughterhouse and get cut. You need your band-aid. I told him prove you do what I do. He gave me lampshade and 
He said, I told him. The house to get cut. You need your band aid. I told him, prove you do what I do. I told him, prove you do what I do. He gave me lampshade. He gave me lampshade and said, no. I gave the bitch room and then the man and said, no. I gave the bitch room and then the man came. A man cave is known as a dude's room, you know, man cave, where it's a, it's a man's room where they chill, play video games, watch TV, whatever, whatever, whatever. But then, and I gave him room, I sat back and gave him some room, and then he caved, like he caved in, he gave in. And put out Silence of the Lamp, bruh. I'll improve you do what I do. He gave me lampshade and said no. I gave the bitch room and then the man cave. Woo! Divide his body. The footage got him seven. Contradicting every lie. Pull yourself together. Divide his body. The footage got him severed. Contradict yourself in every live. Pull your shit together. Divide his body. The footage got him severed. You get you get that. You know in the IG lives when it's more than one person, how it divides people up and it divides your body. The footage got him severed, bro. And then he's like, and you contradict yourself in every single live. Pull your shit together, bruh. Pull yourself together. You say one thing in one live and another thing in another live. Divide his body. The footage got him seven. Contradicting every live. Pull yourself together. Your songs ain't no anthems. Your bar placement random. And you still ain't bring that energy to RJ and Ransom. Nick. Anthems, your bar placement. Your songs ain't no anthems. Contradicting every live. Pull yourself together. Your songs ain't no anthems. Your bar placement random, and you still ain't bring that energy to. Your bar placement random. Together. Your songs ain't no anthems. Your bar placement random, and you still ain't bring that energy to RJ and Ransom. And you still ain't bring that energy to RJ and Ransom. RJ Payne. Formerly known as Rain Man, Battle Rapper, bruh. He does a 60 second uh, freestyle thing on IG. Murder, what's it called? I can't think of it. No anthems, your bar placement random, and you still ain't bring that energy to RJ and Ransom, nigga. I think it's crazy, right? Like, this all started because RJ said him and Ransom was the best. And you responded on IG. You That's true. Never got in the booth and spoke to these niggas. So, yo, I'm a bar they style shack and talk to you, nigga. He says, so I'm going to borrow they style and talk to you. So I'm assuming he's about to rap like RJ Ransom. So yo, I'm a bar they style shack and talk to you, nigga. Got rid of the pounds. I had a yeah. little plan on Montgomery Ave. Bad, I'm dealing that name brand. Catch voice at the register and give him a face scan. This ain't RJ and Sean Kemp original Rain Man. Oh. <laughs> This ain't RJ or Sean Kemp, original Rain Man. I just said RJ Payne was formerly known as Rain Man, R E I G N space M A N Rain Man, and Sean Kemp played Rain in the movie Rain Man with Robert De Niro. That's one of my favorite movies of all time. And he said, see Royce at the register, I give him a face scan. 
sister and give him a face scan. This ain't RJ or Sean Kemp, original Rain Man. Huh. They loving the pressure. Want me to test you? KRS one with the letters. Big pun with the letters on. The He's paying homage. KRS one with the letters. Big pun. They loving the pressure. Want me to test you? KRS one with the lectures. Big pun. No, KRS one with the lectures. Big pun. Hey man, huh? They loving the pressure. Want me to test you? KRS one with the lectures. Big pun with the letters on the with the letters. Roof, but on the roof. The leaf was sick, clutching Beretta's bullets rain over you. Now we really under the weather pain. Randy Nick. Tesha, KRS, one with the lectures, big pun with the letters on the roof. About to leave voice sick, clutching Berettas. About to leave voice sick, clutching Berettas. Bullets rain over you, now we really under the weather. Bullets rain over you, now you really under the weather. Pain. Pain. Randy Nichols, I'm dissecting the. Ah, uh, ransom. The track more fly, elegant rap. His pride get him attacked. This guy skeleton crack to Ryan Melanin's flat. Then the white guy rides with cosine his melanin's black. Don't cry, get little Eminem. Uh Represent Eminem. Back to Ryan Melanin's flat. The little white guy rides with cosine his melanin's black. Don't cry, give him a clap. I'm Lucifer, the Y3 fly devilish. He said, don't cry, give him the clap. Plah! Sign is melanin's black, don't cry, give him a clap. Plah! I'm Lucifer, the Y3 fly, devilish cat who decides heaven is whack. Now he said, I'm Lucifer, the Y3 devilish. Give him a clap. Plah! I'm Lucifer, the Y3 fly, devilish cat who decides. The Y3 fly, devilish cat who decides heaven is whack. Heaven is Royce's studio. You get Lucifer is Satan, the devil. Melanin's black. Heaven, hell. The devil resides in hell. Heaven, hell. He's saying, I'm Lucifer, just, and I decide heaven is whack. I'm the devil, and, and Royce is in, you know. Royce's studio is heaven's studio, and he's saying Royce is whack. Don't cry, give him a clap. I'm Lucifer, the Y3 fly devilish cat who decides heaven is whack. Now my attention is back, applied pressure with facts. Marvel at your multiverse to you, God mentioned in that duff. Marvel at your multiverse. In this back, applied pressure with facts. Marvel at your multiverse to you, God mentioned in that duff. Till you die mentioning that. Flipping Royce's shit up. And Royce's uh, rap, he said, uh, three dimentary. Da -da -da -da. He just said, bruh. Mention this back, apply pressure with facts. Marvel at your multiverse to you. Marvel at your multiverse, Marvel too, like the comics, Marvel, multiverse. Bro. God mentioned in that duffel. That's me paying homage to my niggas, because you were supposed to get in the booth and respond to that, instead of getting on IG on a fucking rant, nigga. I agree. It's your problem, man. And my man killed you. Woke up in the middle of the night. Got you out of here. Quick. And you need to stop running. Stop stop running, nigga. You know what I'm talking about, too. People taking me being unbothered is weakness. Yeah. Mills at the dock. I'm done harboring meekness. Yeah. Rob Marvin know that my son's father's a genius. Yeah. All them dumb shots when I'm on dock with the defense. Uh, I'm dumb shots while I'm unblocked with the defense. Bruh. Know that my son's father's a genius. Bruh. All them dumb shots when I'm on back with the defense. Bruh. Know that my son's father's a genius. Bruh. All them dumb shots when I'm on back with the defense. Bruh. Ryan Montgomery. No, he didn't say I'm blocked. He said something else. My son's father's a genius. Bruh. All them dumb shots when I'm on back with the defense. On back? That must be, uh. 
some kind of player, sports player that plays defense. But know that my son's father's a genius. All them dumb shots when I'm on back with the defense. Ryan Montgomery hiding behind every rhyme he defining as brotherly. I've decided he's. Ryan Montgomery hiding behind every rhymer he defined as brotherly. Ryan Montgomery hiding behind every rhymer he defining as brotherly. I've decided he's grumpily by my discovery. Five Niners trying to be somebody. The upper echelon recognizes by his redundancy. Hove took you off. The upper echelon recognize him by his redundancy trying to be somebody the upper echelon recognizes by his redundancy hove took you off renegade like it was custody your dad ain't god hove took you off renegade like it was custody oh my god bro that's not what happened <laughs> That's not what happened. There was Royce sign with a different label. There were two songs, Rock City and Renegade. Royce chose Rock City, so that left Eminem with Renegade because Renegade was originally Royce and Eminem's song together. And Eminem actually asked Royce's permission to give Jay-Z Renegade and Royce said that's cool Jay-Z got Renegade and then Eminem ended up laying down a verse on Renegade that's what happened but that's a dope ass bar and it'll piss somebody off and that's what you want to do in a diss <laughs> Recognizes by his redundancy. Hove took you off renegade like, like it, it was, was custody. custody. Your dad ain't even pushed back, surprising you suddenly on the sideline, crying uncomfortably. I am abundantly tired and hungrily. I am a gluttony. Why am I suddenly not for loyalty that I'm giving publicly? Lupe is my brother, and I'm a ride with him stubbornly. The Ooh, it's damn syllable rhyming right here, and it's scheming. Uncomfortably, I am abundantly tired and hungrily. I am a gluttony. Why am I suddenly not for loyalty that I'm giving publicly? Lupe is my brother, and I'm a ride with him stubbornly. Defending the best, and nevertheless, adrenaline been in my chest. He getting regrets forever, discrediting the vets while living off Eminem's mess. He got a song with kissing fab. How about? Lupe is my brother, and I'm a ride with him stubbornly. Defending the best, and nevertheless, defending the best. Less adrenaline been in my and nevertheless. And nevertheless, adrenaline been in my chest. Chest, he getting regrets forever discredit. He getting regrets forever discrediting. The vets while living off Eminem. The vets while living off. His mess, he got Eminem's mess, bruh. Best and nevertheless, adrenaline been in my chest. He getting regrets forever discrediting the vets while living off Eminem's mess. He got a song with Kiss and Fab. Read it out the book of Ryan, but I would be lying if I. Eminem's mess, he got a song with Kiss and Fab Read it out the book of Ryan, but I would be lying If I ever said that shit is trash All let's talk about the pen and pad You good at writing this up Say he just gave him props for his album Book of Ryan He said I'd be lying You know, the book of Ryan, he said I'd be lying If I ever said that shit was trash So he's saying it's not trash And I'd be lying if I said it was in the vest while living off Eminem's mess, he got a song with Kiss and Fab. Read it out the book of Ryan, but I would be lying if I ever said that shit is trash. All let's talk about the pen and pad. You good at writing? It's ironic you won with FAB, but you lost to Mr. Fab. Trash. Pen and pad, you good at Ryan, but I would be lying if I ever said that shit is trash. All let's talk about the pen and pad. You good at writing? It's. I'll just talk about the pen and pad. You good at writing. It's ironic you won with FAB, but you lost to Mr. Fab. It's ironic. The pen and pad, you good at writing. It's ironic you won with FAB, but you lost to Mr. Fab. Bruh, you run with FAB, but you lost to Mr. Fab. Royce has got a song with Fab, but. 
Royce went to some kind of battle thing and wasn't really prepared and didn't know and went up against Mr. Fab and lost the battle. The pen and pad, you good at writing. It's ironic you won with FAB, but you lost to Mr. Fat. Trash. Playing Mufasa got you some battle scars. If you would've. Playing Mufasa got you some battle scars. Lion King, first off, Mufasa, I mean, Scar killed Mufasa in the movie The Lion King. And then. Battle Scars is a song with Guy Sebastian and Lupe Fiasco. FAB, but you lost to Mr. Fat. Trash. Playing Mufasa got you some battle scars. If you would have checked the box, you probably on Amazon. If you would have checked the box, you probably on Amazon. To the dying in the jungle, Jordan mean Avatar. I'm Jeff. The box you probably on Amazon instead of dying in the jungle. Jordan mean Avatar. I'm he said you probably on Amazon instead of dying in the jungle. Jordan mean. Hold on. Avatar. Check the box you probably on Amazon instead of dying in the jungle. Jordan mean Avatar. I'm yeah, Jordan mean Avatar. He said you probably online. Basically, you probably on Amazon. You probably online instead of dying in the jungle, instead of being outside in the world doing shit and fighting and doing real shit. You cooped up in the house online. Check the box, you probably on Amazon instead of dying in the jungle. Jordan mean Avatar. I'm Jeff Bezos. Out of space. I'm Jeff Bezos. I'm the creator of Amazon. <laughs> Amazon instead of dying in the jungle. Jordan mean Avatar. I'm Jeff Bezos. Out of space with galactic bars. Wait, that's something that Royce would do. He'll take something from pop culture and exploit it through a point or two like. Oh my god. He said, that's something, he said, wait, that's something that Royce would do. Take something from pop culture and exploit it. That's something that Royce would do. He'll take something from pop culture and exploit it through a point or two, like. Through a point or two, like. Shakari Richardson, Bill Cosby, Con Shakari Richardson, Bill Cosby, flipping Royce's words on him from Royce's Silence of the, La of the Lambda. You know, Royce had that line about all the smoke with, like, Matt Barnes and Shakari Richardson. He had the line about, uh, um, uh, something about, killing, something about, something, kill me softly, either or, it's me or Bill Cosby. And Mickey just flipped all that on him. From pop culture and exploit it through a point or two Like Shikari Richardson, Bill Cosby, common shit Current event bars ain't skills, kinda obvious Current event bars ain't skills, kinda obvious Shikari Richardson, Bill Cosby, common shit Current event bars ain't Common shit A point or two like Shikari Richardson, Bill Cosby, common shit Current event bars ain't skills, kinda obvious You gotta quit doing entendre without comic wit I don't You gotta quit doing entendre Without comic wit Event bars ain't skills, kinda Comic wit Obvious, you gotta quit doing entendre without comic wit I don't subscribe to the wit, I'm the definition he said, I don't subscribe to it. I'm the definition. Yes, you gotta quit. Doing entendre without comic wit. I don't subscribe to the wit. I'm the definition of opposite. Woo! I'm the definition of opposite. He didn't even say, I'm the opposite. He said, I'm the definition of opposite. And what is like, what is the literal definition of opposite? Let me see. Opposite. 
definition. One having a position on the other or further side of something, facing something, especially something of the same type. Two, diametrically different of a contrary kind. That's the adjective. Noun form of opposite is a person or thing that is totally different from or the reverse of someone or something else. Damn. Doing entendre without comic wit. I don't subscribe to the way. I'm the definition, definition of the opposite. opposite. Chain punching. You do Tetris, I do column shit. You do Tetris, I do column shit. I'm the definition, the opposite. Ooh. Chain punching. You do Tetris, I do column shit. Get stoned with a great structure until your mind a lift. Get stoned with a great structure to your monolith. You do Tetris, I do column shit. Get stoned with a great structure until your monolith. Obelisk, look what I'm amounting to. A steep yes at my peak next. No TV when Ryan Seacrest top it. Ooh, the whole mountain crest steep bars. Look what I'm amounting to. A steep yes. Look what I'm amounting to. It's steep yes. At my peak next, no TV. At my peak next, no TV. Be when Ryan C. Crest. When Ryan C. Crest. Ryan C. Crest was the host of like American Idol forever. But then you split it up like he said no TV when Ryan. When Royce C. Crest C. Crest The peak of a mountain The peak of a mountain top The top Bruh Look what I'm amounting to a steep yes At my peak next no TV When Ryan C. Crest top of the hill Here's the cliffhanger like Top of the hill Here's the cliffhanger like a Cosby closet, eat Cosby closet. Here's the cliffhanger, like Cosby closet in the Cosby show. Bill Cosby played Cliff Huxtable. Here's the cliffhanger, like Cosby closet. A hanger that you hang your clothes on and put them in a fucking closet. Cosby closet, a cliffhanger, and then a cliffhanger like the mountain. Oh my god. Next, no TV when Ryan Seacrest top of the hill. Here's the cliffhanger like Cosby closet, eating pork, claiming Muslim hogwash. Ryan Wallace. Eating pork, claiming Muslim. Hog wash, right, bruh. Is the cliffhanger like Cosby closet eating pork, claiming Muslim hogwash? Ryan Wallen, stop it, novice. Listen, one. He said hogwash, Ryan Wallen. He said basically he's a fucking phony, a fake, a liar, whatever, whatever. Closet eating pork, claiming Muslim hogwash. Ryan Wallen, stop it, novice. Listen, what I'm giving you. Yeah, check boxes. Wow. That's what morticians do. He said, Yeah, I check boxes. That's what morticians do. Because Royce and the IG thing was talking about checking boxes and shit. Bro. And he just flipped that on him and said, yeah, I check boxes. That's what morticians do. Mortician is somebody who deals with dead bodies and gets them ready for, like, the funeral and shit. And then bombs them and shit. They check boxes, like, in the morgue or, or casket or however you want to look at it. 
a novice. Listen what I'm giving you. Yeah, I check boxes. Wow. That's what morticians do. And stop fibbing too, nigga. You was mad at gas and turned to rock him with the ass. They like the aftermath. Did the same thing with pain. Then you got. Oh my god. Gas and turned to rock him. That's what morticians do. And stop fibbing too. And stop fibbing too. Stop lying. Oh, nigga, you was mad at gas. And you was mad at Cass. Turn to rock him when he and turn to rock him. Yes, they like the aftermath. Did this when he asked, didn't like the aftermath. Aftermath is also bruh. Same thing with pain. Did the same thing with pain. And you got scolded. He had then you got scolded. Had you holding on your chin like Francois wrote it. Look what I he had did he had you holding on your chin like Francois Rollin? Bruh pain, then you got scolded. He had you holding on your chin like Francois Rollin. Look what I have sculpted. Nigga talking checking boxes. Look what I have sculpted. Come on, bruh. And on your chin like Francois Rollin. Look what I have sculpted. Nigga talking checking boxes. Why three all the time? Never a checking box. Yeah. <laughs> Why three all the time? Never a check in boxes. Why three the damn Yeezy shoes? Is Adidas and that, uh, I think it's a Japanese dude. What's his name? His name starts with a Y. And that's why I call him Y3. And the three stands for the three stripes on Adidas. And he said Y3 all the time. Never check in boxes. Nikes. Nike shoe boxes. They're in my shoe boxes, it's all Y3s. It ain't never no check, no Nike. Bruh! Okay, checking boxes. What? Y3 all the time. Never a check in boxes. Yeah. They'll find this chicken head dismembered in checker boxes. Yeah. God, they'll find this chicken head dismembered in checkers boxes. Checkers, the restaurant, they serve chicken. Three all the time, never a check in box. Yeah. They'll find this chicken head dismembered in checker boxes. Yeah. I'm Bobby Fisher, you playing chess with checker boxes. I'm Bobby Fisher, you playing chess with checker boxes. Bobby Fisher, the greatest chess player of all time. Chicken head dismembered in checker boxes. Yeah. I'm Bobby Fisher, you playing chess with checker boxes. He loved MMA. Every day he checking boxes. He loved MMA. Every day he checking boxes. Joe Budden dick riding, look at Royce checking boxes. <laughs> Joe Budden dick riding, look at Royce checking boxes. Every day checking boxes. Joe Budden dick riding, look at Royce checking boxes. <laughs> Money in the mail, man. I see the checking boxes. Money in the mail, man. I see the check in boxes. Paycheck in the mailbox. Dick riding, look at Royce checking boxes. Money in the mail, man. I see the checking boxes. Your chick be in my DMs when I check in boxes. Yeah. Your chick. Be in my DMs when I be checking boxes. My inbox is DMs. Your inbox. The mailman, I see the checking boxes. Your chick be in my DMs when I check in boxes. Yeah, ask women. This guy know I'm checking boxes. Fuck that. Ask women. This guy know I'm checking boxes. Gynecologist is a female doctor. Box is also a slang term for a woman's coochie. He said, ask women, this guy know, I'm checking boxes. Oh my God. In my DMs when I check in boxes. Yeah, ask women, this guy know, I'm checking boxes. Fuck that, I'm Craig on Friday. I ain't checking boxes, they y'all. Fuck that, I'm Craig on Friday, I ain't checking box, bruh, the whole checking boxes scheme was fire. This guy know I'm checking boxes, fuck that, I'm Craig on Friday, I ain't checking boxes, they all thinking I ain't got fire, literally, you not Christopher Nolan, Ryan, fuck what you pitching me on IG. Ooh. 
I'm checking boxes. Fuck that. I'm Craig on Friday. I ain't I... checking boxes. They all thinking I ain't got fire. Li they all thinking I ain't got fire. Literally. Literally, you not Christopher Nolan. Ryan, fuck what you pitching me on. You not Christopher Nolan. Ryan, fuck what you pitching me. Nolan Ryan was a baseball player. Fuck what you pitching me. Pitching, baseball, Nolan Ryan, baseball player. Christopher Nolan is like a director or some shit of movies. You pitch, you, you know, you pitch ideas. You pitch shit to directors about movies. Bruh, Christopher Nolan Ryan. Fuck what you pitching? Oh my god. I'm thinking I ain't got fire literally. You not Christopher Nolan. Ryan, fuck what you pitching me on IG. The way that I handled it showed humility. But this nigga bathing in arrogance, insecurity. Mm. Disparaging words by Lupe making Euro. Mmm. Wow. Disparaging words about Lupe making mural. That's a highly requested song people have asked me to react to is mural by uh Lupe, that I need to check that out. Is it a song or an album? Or both? I don't know, but I know I've seen it a lot in the comment section. Lupe Fiasco Mural. Nigga, bathing in arrogance, insecurity, disparaging words by Lupe making mural. Wow. You tried to do it and failed. You should have called the plural word. You tried to do it and failed. You should have called it plural. Urgh! your words by Lupe making mural. Wow. You tried to do it and failed. You should have called it plural. Word. Lay him face down and ask him you want a war. No. Lay him face down and ask him you want a war. Do it and fail, you should have called the plural word. Lay him face down and ask him you want a war. No spine, this is easy. I'm back to the drawing. Bo Face down and ask him, you want a war? No spine, this is easy, I'm back to the drawing, boy. Now no spine, this is easy, I'm back to the drawing board. Lay him face down, ask him, do he want to go to war? No spine, you lay somebody face down, what are you looking at? their fucking back, their spine. And he's also saying you ain't got no spine, you ain't got no backbone, you're a coward. This is easy. Now I'm going back to the drawing board. Bruh. Why she don't respond to this shit? Any money bet, the nigga don't say nothing. And Royce, you know how I give it up. We gonna do this until 2022, nigga. Ooh, let's go, Mickey. He said, why she won't respond to this shit? He won't say a word. You know how I'm... Somewhere in this disc, he said, you know how I roll, Royce. Or roll, you get it, Rolls Royce, roll, Royce. But he said, we doing this till 2022. <laughs> Let's go. Do it. Keep putting them out. D Yo. I know Royce uh, did talk shit on IG. It was talking about Mickey's uh, diss and Lupe's and all that stuff on IG. Bruh. I hope Royce does respond. And I, you know, as long as this all of this stays in the music, I'm here for it. You know what I'm saying? I don't want nothing crazy to happen. But, bro, Mickey fucking just came in and just slaughtered the fuck out of, oh my God. This, ladies and gentlemen, is what real... Hip hop diss tracks are. Holy mother of all the mothers in the whole motherland.
from the title being a double entendre to the fucking cover art to every single line of the fucking song. This is what a diss track's supposed to be. I like this better than Lupe's, even. I'm not... That's not me throwing shade at Lupe at all. Because I love Lupe. And Lupe still beat Royce, in my opinion. But Mickey just came in and said, Bruh, oh my god, this was fucking amazing, and I'm here for it, and I hope to see more, I hope to see more, Mickey, homie, bruh, yes, salute, bruh, love it, love it, y'all comment below, y'all stop, be real, be respectful, please, but be real. Please click on the link in the description box. Make sure you go like, comment, share, subscribe. All that wonderful stuff. Now we wait. Please like this video on your way out. Live report that you think. And please subscribe to my channel, y'all. April G. Score. Fist bump. Love y'all. And I'll see y'all in just a little bit. Peace out.